Good evening. It's an apparent miracle. So far, no one is reported dead after a Navy F-18 crashed into a Virginia Beach apartment complex and burned. You will be amazed when we show you the video that has people shaking their heads tonight. The two pilots ejected just before this impact. Tonight, people call it miraculous that only nine people were hurt. Those injuries considered minor. The Navy blames the crash on a catastrophic mechanical function. ABC's Todd Ant has the latest. It's a miracle no one died in the inferno. I pray now is where we don't find any more victims. So far, we've been very lucky. Lucky indeed. The Navy fighter jet crashed into a dense residential neighborhood shortly after takeoff from the Naval Air Station Oceana. The pilots immediately detected a massive fuel leak and dumped fuel before the F-18 dove into an apartment complex. I heard a jet coming in, and it was a lot louder than they normally are. And uh, I looked up, and uh, sparks were shooting out the side of it, and it just came right into the building right over there where it caught fire. And Dozens of police cars, fire trucks, and other emergency vehicles filled the neighborhood. Multiple buildings were engulfed in flames. It's believed the two jet pilots waited until the last moment to eject to avoid hitting nearby schools. Both of those aircrew ejected safely. The front seater was a, a student pilot. Uh, the back seater was an experienced instructor. One of the aviators landed on Colby Smith's porch. I saw the pilot, I saw the parachute on the house, and he was still connected to it, and he was laying on the ground with his face full of blood. Smith took care of the Navy man. The pilot said, I'm sorry for destroying your house. And I just bent down and I, and I touched him. I was like, it's, it's okay, it really is, are, are you okay? And he was like, I think I am. Then the pilot apologized to him for crashing into the apartment complex that's just a few miles away from the Naval Air Station. Todd Ant, ABC News, New York.